Hey everyone, welcome back to episode 3. I literally just recorded episode 2, so yeah, we're here again. This game is phenomenal, best game ever, I'll be honest. Let's get started. So, what I want to do today is, I want to do a few rounds of night mode, because yeah. night mode seems very interesting. I hope we can do it on different maps, because I don't want to do a bunch of just Sun Speckled Terrence. Oh, okay, so we, we do the different landing zones in the map that's cool okay 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 so glow pikmin are amazing i love them i left the glow pikmin behind in the last episode in a cave and i feel very bad for it if you by the way spoilers you know if you guys didn't know spoilers <laughs> so be careful watching this video if you haven't played the game already last episode was absolutely crazy all my nightmares became true and here we are, the beautiful Glow Pikmin. It's lovely to see you guys again. Okay, did we just start? No, we have to get a cutscene, of course. Uh, let's Glow Pikmin. Yeah. Oh? Oh, okay, this is just about their, um... This music, though. Interesting part is that they lose their flowers when you do it, so... That's a thing to think about. Okay. About the Glow Pikmin, you'll need more, absolutely. That's why I'm more than ready to get a bunch of this Stardust stuff. Alright, so when these guys are done, they teleport to you. This is so nicely set up. I love... Oh, hi. I love how they've um, managed this. Where, like, your Pikmin uh, will... Is there a bubble up there? There is. Uh-oh. And they've triggered. Okay. Scary stuff. But I love how your glow Pikmin are never left idle. They always teleport back to you and stuff. It makes just everything so smooth in this game mode. And allows you to multitask on like a whole nother level. Let's give this a try. Oh wait, that's OG. Ouch. So I don't think glow Pikmin can die during night mode. I'm not sure. How about one of these? Ochi, you're going to die. Watch out. Okay. So we've got a bunch of bulb orbs showing up this time. Which is kind of scary. Hit him with a glow mob again. Concerned about Ochi's HP? Yeah, me too. Oh, there's a cooldown on it. Bob. Enjoy. Okay, so... I really enjoyed the um, gameplay loop of Night Mode. It's brilliant. Okay, we got dudes up there. we got to be fast about this, because we're going to have guys attacking. Wait, can we... Yes, yes, yes. No. No way we can't get up there. Okay. Sneak attack. Oi, oh, don't touch Ochi. Have I, got op have I got items? You can use items. Let's go. Okay. Scrummy bone. Throw it down. Ochi, eat it. Eat it, Ochi. Go on, smack him. Smack that dude. Oh, they can eat ghosts, Pikmin. Protect the Luminol? What do you mean? Oh no. Okay, this is um this is picking up. This is picking up. Get out of here. The music's going all scary like type B. Glow Pikmin are actually dying, so they're not invincible. I don't know where I heard that. Why are you so big? Is that just me? That's not just me. New creature discovered. Yeah, tell me about it. Look at the size of that dude. Is that it? And that gives us our glow sap. That is a cure for another dude. Put the effort out here, out there. Putting the effort out there, new blood. Thank you very much. Look at that, the glow sap. I'd eat that up in an instant, man. That gives us a, those glow pills, man. I'd eat that up in an instant. Oh, hello. All right, we're gonna cu cure the joint eye dude. I wish you could kind of fit a day and a night mode into one day. Alright, let's cure this dude. Yes, Captain. Who is it? Eat that pill. What's up? Welcome back to the world, Korg Win. 
from Moyama. He's faro, fast, reckless, and presumptuous, which also describes his plan to build houses. Whoa. Okay, how about another night mode? Um, Corgan would like to speak with you, will he? He'd be like, hey, yo, you want a house? Because I got you, fam. Cheers for saving me. Rescue the TV crew? What? So that's, that's at least an extra three castaways just for this dude. Plus, there's an entire classroom of kids to save. Plus, there's God knows who else in this game. Louie as well? Where's Louie at? Where's the Kupaitis at? Where's, where's all those characters? Are they going to show up? Because if they do, I'm going to lose it. I'm going to actually lose it. I want to look at the Piclopedia. So let's look at these dudes. So the Spring Jab family, the Sheer Flea. So are they? They're not the same family as Sheer Grubs, but they do have similar naming. That's interesting. Jumbo Bulborb, like what? Oh my God! <laughs> Hello. Okay, great spot of jelly floats. Lesser spot of jelly floats. So I was right about the naming. Crusted Rump Up. <laughs> Oh my god. What a dude. Okay. Luminols are here? That's cool. Can probably use Glow Pikmin in the Pikipedia. I mean, we'll check we'll check that all out some other time. Corgwin was it? I love you, Corgwin. You're an absolute G. Why is it any character that has like the big like the big body shape is just an absolute G? Oh, Ochi's gonna learn something new. Ochi can protect the Luminol. That's cool. I love that. Is that a Jumbo Bob? He looks very big, so... I imagine so. Oh no, Bob of Lava. Uh-oh, we got Bob of Lava coming up in here, so... That's no good. Ochi, can you just go sort them out? Like, is that something you can do? Oh, we can. <laughs> go on, Ochi, you got him. I'm trying. Is it being attacked? Doesn't look like it to me. Alright, Ochi is making work of those dudes over there. I, I respect it, you know. Better not lose Ochi. He won't. He's a legend. So can you, like, stop them from spawning if you get rid of that? Okay, let's get him on that. Dirt Man Excavation complete. So are they gone now? Is that, is that what's going down? Oh no. Hello. There you go. You can absolutely just like rain hell. Go on then. Okay, scary stuff. Bob. <laughs> oh my god, he is startled. Okay, there's a lot of these dudes coming. Oh my god, the music's really picking up too. Oh, jump up. Luminol's under attack. That's the first time it's been attacked. I only just got the cutscene. Get rid of those creatures. I'm, I'm on it, lad. I'm on it. Don't you worry. We good. It's only... Why is it like the most dramatic music ever? It's just one baby. Ochi, you good? Yeah, he's just spawn camping them. Oh, how are you? Would you like one of these? Just that. Uh, just wondering. Wood? Okay. Daytime is coming. Can't get up there. I'm going to. Alright. Do you think I can get these in time? I don't think so. But I'll try. Come on, you guys can do it. Better not lose Ochi. Don't worry, he's good. I think. Go on, if all these dudes can get backwards, we're set. Oh. Okay, I actually don't think it means... I think it just means more glow Pikmin, which doesn't matter in the long term, in the long run. Like, can I get two glow saps or something? For, you know, getting all the star bits, or most of them? Just one. It feels like it could do two. I feel like it's potentially... potentially could do two. That is another pill. Who are we going to cure this time? We're going to cure... Purple Man. This one was done dirty by Olimar. Who is it? Hey, yo, oh, it is him. <laughs> a veteran pilot who started 
in the private sector before joining the rescue corps, he's always brimming with optimism. He's got damn glasses on! Ha ha, what is it you're trying to say? So he's mad at me for running after all. Oh. Dango, get your ass out of it, please. Please! Oh, nothing, just a little joke! Good, good, finally, all the members of the rescue corps are together again. Hereby, Rin's primary mission on our Captain Omar. Copy that! Perfect response. You must be the secret weapon our captain's been talk ta talking to me about. Thank you very much for saving me. Excuse me, Captain. This may pertain to the subject of certain Captain Onomar's whereabouts. I found a logbook entry that caught my interest. Why is he speaking capitals sometimes? I don't know. The last push. At long last, my goal to collect all lost SS dolphin parts is nearly complete. According to the ship's radar, the remaining pieces are inside the giant structure. My life support system is reaching its limit. One last push now. That's dark. As always, the rest is up to you, Wigo Manochi. As always, officers to your stations, please. What are you doing at your stations? Having a sit down? Ochi, you good? Ochi, you good? Okay, Ochi has a leaf on his tail with no explanation. That's kind of scary. Create a new item. Prototype. Let's have a look. Terence, what are you saying? You can prototype make these? What? Oh, that's in the submerged castle. <laughs> Boy. You can just use those on the dot, like when you want. What's this? The Trachonator? A bomb that always tracks its prey and never loses it in the wild. I must rather be the chaser than the chasey. That is insane. <laughs> you can make tracking bombs. Triple threat. Oh, is this the punch? Yes. I've got to get that. Tough stuff, I guess. Plus. Sure. Tough stuff for Ochi, too. So, do I get a new area now? Yeah. So, now we get the house. A significant chance that Captain Olmar is here. Keep an eye out for him as you explore. Okay, I want, I'm going to do one more day at, at Serene Shores, then we'll go to the house, okay? It's, uh, I hope there's going to be another map after the house. Or maybe another map after the house, after the house map. Alright, so I want to head straight down the middle where the Hydro Jelly was. Straight into the big ocean area, I think. So this area looks massive back here. I'm very excited. We got, oh, very deep water. We got Pucker and Blinners. We got Tony Bloisters. We got the Moai statue. I'm guessing he's going to be heavy. I mean... Purples will be able to come over here when uh, the tide goes out, which is cool. The tide goes down. Oh, <laughs> that was a bit weird then. I want to put Ochi on this. So we'll do that. There's also spider warts right by base here. I could probably um, put some dudes on those. Actually, we can come around here. I'm, I'm interested in around here. Let's, let's do it. Beautiful area. Like, look at this. Is there going to be like a boss here or something? I'm scared. Loving the underwater section so far. Ooh, what is that? Oh, it's like a fossil. God damn, that's a shiny fossil. Okay. And this lets us come up in here. Wow. Hello, Blino. Oh, Ochi, you got here. <laughs> Yo, get him. I feel like one of these is going to pull up some... Yep! <laughs> what did I say? Hi. Pikmin, move. Pikmin, move! Oh. He's blocking him, he's blocking him. Alright, we'll try this one on then. Wah! Boom! Oh no, that's bad. Alright, yeah, do your bubbles. Do your bubble business. Good mind. Ochi, you need to. Hi! Stop. Please die. Ochi, you're doing such a bad job right now, I'm sorry. Come on, just give him a smack! 
There we go. Holy, Pekka's wrist crab, don't mess around no more. Alright, well that was a cool little area back there. There's a uh, hydro jelly back there. I don't think I've been back there at all yet, so we've got to check that out too. You can. Okay. Dive! <laughs> That's fun. We've got grapes. We've got a uh, dusk pustules, or is it dawn pustules? Hey, yo, chill. Get them all, get them all. Alright, we're in like the... We're in the Pikmin... The Pikmin free zone here. We got... We got the, um... Whatever that is. The Zest Bomb. That's the one. And then we've got... The Dawn Pustules. I think that's the Dawn Pustules. How many rubber ducks are in this game, by the way? Where's Captain Charlie at? You know he loves his rubber ducks. Do you want to just pick it up? Maybe. Why? Okay, there we go. Hope you're having a nice little swim there, Ochi. Um, in fact, we've got a wall here. Ochi, do you want to chill there for a sec? I'm just like, yeah. I don't know why he has a leaf on his tail. I'm kind of scared about that. Here we go. I can actually come back here now. So we've got more of these puffer fish dudes. I, I really like the uh, the kind of like shallow little rock pool areas. That's, that's one thing. I think I mentioned it last episode. That's one thing I've always wanted. Yeah, as a Pikmin area. Okay, so that's... We need Ochi here, plus Ice Pikmin. Unless this drains out. This probably drains it out, actually. That's what I'm going to assume. So we'll put that there. Yeah, okay. What a drain. Perfect. It's about that time that the tide goes in. Oh, these guys come out when the tide goes down. I love like the nature and like realism they put into the world that makes it like so much more of an actual world than just, you know, oh, there happens to be <coughs> these creatures that, you know, activate specifically when enemies, when Pikmin are here and stuff like that. Like the world lives on without you having to be exactly there, which is what I love. Can you kill this guy? No, I guess not. You charge him? Is that... Whoa! Is that Pikmin's cry just now? It sadly was, Colin. I apologise. Probably Clam Clans are scary now. Oh, they ain't, they ain't even... Just be careful. There's like alien type music down here. This is weird. Oh, I see Ochi on the surface. I see a shadow. Ochi, you distracted me. Alright, throw him as fast as you can. And we're good. Look at that. That's kind of messed up. They like... Also, Flarlick. That's 80 Pikmin out at a time now. But check this out. Back here. Couldn't go on top of the corals and stuff. This is amazing. Grab that, please. Why isn't that dude helping? I don't understand. Pikmin is still stupid, but that's... That's... that's It's not Pikmin without stupid Pikmin, am I right? Flalik! That gives us a maximum of 80 at a time, I think, now. Which is insane. Gone from 20 to 80. I mean, we started with 40. Oh, no. Those dudes got in a scrap with a Pekka's Aristocrab. They won. <laughs> but... Okay. I forgot about that dude. <laughs> Sneaky dude. Walk over there. Get that cave out of the way. So we don't have to go back all the way to the back of there. Again. Well, he's on his way. We shall do whatever, I guess. Dig out these. There is actually a treasure up here I saw that was um, very close. So I thought we might as well go grab it now, right? Oh. Is that a normal chromat or is that a... Is that the big dude? There's no way that's the big dude, right? Bug-eyed chromat? That's the one. Okay, you guys will come the right way, right? There's the treasure. What else? Alright, that's everything.
below below grade disco f whatever that is okay I'm hyped for this level I'm so hyped for this level so let's give ourselves 30 reds 30 yellows and then take like rocks and then rocks rocks are fun the disco stuff sounds awesome maybe this will be where you find where you find white Pikmin I don't know I feel like there's gonna be a new type in here oh it might be winged I think it might be winged okay so like what is that? White Pikmin orb? <laughs> oh, hi. Holy, you need to chill. Just throw a bunch of rocks on him. <laughs> Got rocks charge. Bob. Yeah, but we're gonna make a train track eventually. We've got loads of pieces to it. Oh, they've recreated this little sub level, the one where there's usually like a groin on top. Okay, there's a lot of tusked logs down there, which kind of scares me. But the amount of pure firepower we have seems to be enough to uh, combat that. Especially with the rocks, they just pepper them. Okay, so can anyone get up here? They can, okay. Good. Love hearing the rocks again, man. It's so cool. It's so cool to have all the dudes in one game, like genuinely. So where, when's like the massive disco ball gonna come down from the sky and be like, oh yeah, dance? And everyone's like, oh, I can't stop dancing, and then they fall off and die. So we got helicopter platforms. We got oh, the, we got the little nits, fleas, nits. Do you guys ever have nits? I think I feel like it. most people have as a kid, and oh, it's it's hard. It's a horrible thought. Oh, chill, chill. Like just having, just imagine just having bugs in your hair. Like, ugh! I didn't want. I didn't want to think about it. Got rocks. Yes. Okay, I'm happy I bring the rocks. They're a lot of fun. It's also great to see them. Just you know, combat their Pikmin free, their Pikmin free friends, and absolutely and, like annihilate them. I like these guys. I also hate them. I don't, I don't know what to think about them. Got a big old treasure over there. Wow. There we go. Pikmin are having trouble. That is fine because they will soon be not having trouble. Let's get all those. And then we can go hit the switch and let Ochi through. And also let the uh, that treasure get through. Oh, yeah, all these guys are stuck. I don't know why those small guys are stuck. They should be able to carry through there. There we go. Ochi, you should be able to come through now, my friend. Rock, rock. Oh my god. That was weird. Okay. So that was just a little loop. So we got the cave exit there. So what can I, like, tell Ochi to do? We've got loads of commands now. we got, like, go to base, gather Pikmin. Gather Pikmin, come on. The caves still don't make a lot of sense. In the context of, like, how is this underneath a sandcastle? Like, but I, I love that. I feel like that's a special part about the, uh, the caves. Got a big old candle that's a light. Like, who set the candle alight? Like, damn. Trying to have a romantic evening out here? I'm sorry if I came in and, like, ruined it. Spice is great. I get a lot of... Am I lucky, or are they very common? <laughs> okay, what? What is that about? Oh! I see a winged candy pot butt up there. You know what that means, guys. We've got the mushrooms from Pikmin 3, too. Oh, my God. All right, what happens if I throw a dude on there? Where does he go? They go down there. Okay. Oh, do so these... Do these open up to each other? Or am I insane? Get down there, my friends. Dig him out. Okay, so I think these are like tunnels that connect to each other or something. I don't know where these guys are going, but I'm just throwing them and hope they go somewhere cool. Oh, they go back down there. Oh, wait, no? Oh, are they in a loop? <laughs> That's funny. There we go. 
So can you take this? <laughs> a little, little camera change like that, that's cool. Alright, I see ya. Where are these guys on there? This sub level's pretty damn interesting, actually. Alright, I like how the light actually is like real time on my character. Alright, so we got. Can you put Bud there? Can we throw him in now? Can. Okay, Wing Pikmin, by the way. Out of nowhere. You love to see him. Okay, so. Change the direction. Are they going to end up somewhere better now? Oh, I think I did it by accident. Okay. Then they should push this box, right? Straight up. Perfect. Did it by accident. Let's go. Just throw a bunch of Pikmin on there and hope they do the right thing. <laughs> That's the best way. Alright, we've got another train piece. Bridge piece. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. Uncalled for. Oh, there's the exit. Okay. How exactly do we get to the winged Pikmin then? Go back up. Uh, I don't see any way to get up there. Oh, 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 oh! Haha, <laughs> that's so cool! <laughs> All right, are you guys ready? Here they are. Oh yes! Beautiful little cutscene. Good to hear their little voices again as well. Variety of Pikmin types never ceases to amaze me. They are beautiful. As their name suggests, winged Pikmin have sprouted wings and can fly. Of course, this means they can transport things by air and can save time that and can save time that way. Their ground attacks are lackluster, but when it comes to aerial combat, they are unmatched. That's absolutely right, Olimar. Azar, the sky is no longer out of our reach. We got the homies. We got the homies down here. Okay, so. I think that's everything. The only real hard part was getting the wing there, so... Now that we've got those, we can head straight out of here, I think. I think this was the way to the cave exit, right? Yeah. Alright, very kind of scary some level actually. It's, I feel like I'm just going to fall. <laughs> Obviously not, though. Sub-level 4, okay. Why do I feel like there's a ball bear on this floor? This is like a ball bear floor. Let's work. See, look, spicy spray again. Is it my luck or what? Got bubble hazard down here. Careful. Okay, got tusked blowhog. Would you like to get spanked? Yep. Has man been playing Bloons Tower Defense? Is that what's going down? I'm gonna ignore the fact that he spewed up a dart that doubled the size of him. That must have hurt, you know. How did he swallow it in the first place? That's my question. Oh, it'd be cool if wings could just fly over the void. There you go. It's so cool to see him flying again, though. To see him in action. Ah, I love you, Wing Pikmin. Although, it's kind of sad there isn't a bubble blog yet. Maybe there is, but I don't know. I, I feel like there is a go. You know. They so could, though. Alright, we've got some paraclasmic sluches here. Close one. Okay, so we've got like a... Another... What's it, another valve, I think it is. I think it's a valve. Okay, down here we got... Oh! Pigmen having trouble? Uh-oh. Oh no, that's bad. Okay. I've learned from my mistakes. That should... Disignite. Disignite. Get rid of the floor. You know. The blogs have disappeared. Blogs are going to have a nice little shower there. So will that, will that stay watery? Okay, it turns off. I was going to say. The fire's out. Perfect. Alright, Ochi, what's going on up there, my dude? We got... Hmm, treasure? Oh... 
No way. Do, do they make you throw Pikmin up to up to him? No, no, no. No, 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 no. Rock. What is wrong with you guys? Okay, let's get some reds on him. Don't get thrown off the edge, please. That's kind of risky. Alright, Ochi, you need to do something about this quick. Oh, well, I've, I whistled them all by accident. Perfect. Ten. Press the button. And now that means that we can be a bit more safer about how we go around this. Also, I, I've noticed that I haven't seen a lot of caves utilize the um, multiple multiple spawn points and stuff. The, the multiple... Um, oh, candy for bud. Perfect. The multiple uh, different places where a ship can land because those are in caves which because we saw them in Sun Speckled Terrence in the first area but there hasn't been a lot of them so far okay there we go we got 10 wings now oh look at this oh this is the intended way okay I was gonna say this is a cool little secret all right you guys got that I believe so so we got four types plus Ochi right now Mentor only have three, but of course, if you find wild Pikmin in a cave, that can bring up your total number of wild Pikmin of uh, different types out, even. Pretty cool. Is that all the treasure? It is. So, we can continue. Is this the final floor? I think this might be. Which is scary news, because that means we're going to see one hell of a dude down here, I'm pretty sure. There he is. It's the dude from the trailer. <sighs> okay, I'm so ready for this fight. He best have custom music. He needs to have some, like, disco-ass, like, tune. Like, that'd be so good. Okay, I say we go in with reds. I definitely don't want to kill my wing, so... Maybe rocks can survive. I don't know. I'm not going to risk it because it's a hard floor and he's got hard feet, so. Hello. Oh, he's here. Oh, my God. That is cool. He has got his own theme. I knew it. Okay, so he's like puff stall. What is this? Okay, so he's glowing yellow. Does that mean I have to use yellows, or...? Hey, yo! Damn! So, now he's like ice mode. I hear ya! Hey, yo! BD, chill out! What are you saying? Remix that? Yo, hit that remix again! What does that mean? <laughs> hey, 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 give me some room, give me some room. Bow, bow, bow. Go on, slow that shit down. All right, all right, all right. Oh, oh. What you said? Woo! Hey, yo! 
Speedy, you gotta chill, bro. Alright, you good? You done? That was fire! Best fight, best boss fight, hands down. I never jigged so much during a boss battle, lad. I'll be honest. Oh, a castaway, by the way. Forget about that. How much did that give us? Wow. But that that was that was lethal. What kind of tune was that? Like, oh my god. Like, that, sh that shit had me, like... Who is it? It's got... Whoever's locked down here, I I'm sure they ain't even mad. I'm... They must have been chilling. Osa from Cigarette. Like, man, man wasn't even concerned about being saved or picked up. He was jamming. An archaeologist tracking the path of civilization across the universe. He hopes his discoveries will shock the world of academia. Marble. A ruin excavation specialist. He probably came to this planet to do research. Excellent rescue work. Bring him on back. Yep. Talk about an amazing cave. That was crazy. Alright. The music's so good in this game. Oh. Whatever that beat was, that devilish beat that Raven Longlegs was playing, hook me up with that. Oh my god. He needs to drop his mixtape. You see what Rafe dropping his mixtape? No one cares. If he dropped his mixtape, I'd be like, sound. I, yeah, I'll take it. Okay, so there's going to be like 10 seconds left. So because we have a little, so little time, let's just get our unique boys out just to look cool. Hey, look at my dudes. Another successful day in the world of Pikmin 4. That boss fight was crazy. I am so happy he has his own theme because at the start, I don't know if you heard it, but it, it made the same like kind of um, introduction boss theme. I was like, oh, it's just going to be like normal boss theme. But no, he's got his own tune. There's so many dudes here now. Wow. And I think we should finish the episode off with two more night mode missions and maybe another in-game day I'm not sure but I do want to cure all of the dudes we have at the moment so we completed a series we got even more treasure holy almost 3,000 sparkling in one day okay all right so this dog moss comes up quite a lot in Captain Omar's voyage log I'm very intrigued. Perhaps we'll encounter her sometime, somewhere on this planet. Yeah, we have multiple times. There's a lot like cat. Are you guys dumb? So, because they don't, they don't know it's Olimar, right? The dude who's playing us up. So, they also don't know that Moss is the dog. When Moss is literally just the dog. There's, there's nothing. There's no disguise or anything. Moss is Louie. How about that for a theory? I don't know anything. Okay, if Moss is Louie, shouts to me. Okay, I wasn't. I didn't see any spoilers. So. Oh, we, okay, so we cleared what seems to be the final area. Look at that. Look at those beautiful bricks. They're beautiful. Okay, after many castaway requests, we're adding even more space to the rescue command post. I'm guessing that's the most we're going to extend it. Thing is, though, where do they sleep? Like, they haven't built any huts, any houses, or anything. They just all sleep on the floor. Uh, maybe you could build some people some houses here, because, you know, everyone's sleeping on the floor right now. Maybe you and uh, the construction dude could team together. We keep curing the, the, the Olimar dudes. I'm really intrigued of what these dudes are going to be, because, I don't know, the blue one, he seems interesting, I don't know why. Ooh, okay, so, it's good to know that night mode is possible in all the other stages. Is it possible in the house? Imagine? Night mode in the house? Like, does that even make sense? Okay, who's going to show up tonight, then? Can Ochi carry them? He can. Uh, Ochi, can I command you to protect... Alright. We got a Luminol up here, or a Trick Null, or whatever they're called. Do you want to carry to that? Because it's closer. No? Okay. Alright, I need to ice. keep forgetting to upgrade Ochi. 
I need to upgrade his bite, so then maybe, and his health, because then maybe you'll actually be good for night mode. Because I don't know what poor Ochi's going to do to one of those. Desiccated scare leaves. Alright, Ochi, I'm sure you could take those guys on. Holy, look at them. They're scary. Alright, chill. Oh, you evil man. Okay, get rid of them. Perfect. Alright, oh, we've got another Luminol back here. Pretty exciting. We're attacking the Trick Null. Ochi, do you want to go sort them out? No? Ochi, what's up? What's good? Alright, I'm scared. I'm a little bit scared. We've got a lot of creatures incoming. Oh, we've got Joust Mites up in this? Oh, no. Okay, Ochi. Why am I controlling just Ochi? What happened to... <laughs> what happened to the dude? Ask Wigwam to protect... Oh, is that better? Because my dude can straight up just actually, you know, like... Punch him or a pro Pikmin. Okay, I'm playing as just Ochi right now. I wish I wish there was like a not so short option of night mode, so you could just kind of go. Maybe there's an endless mode or something you unlock. Imagine endless night mode, that'd be so good. All right, so if I swap to Wigwam, the glow Pikmin should come to me, right? They do. Okay, good, because we're gonna need them. Oh, you leave them alone. I'm busy carrying, bro. That's brutal. Uh, is that it? Okay, yeah, it, they are very short. They're like five minutes. Who is going to get cured? I don't know because I don't get to decide. Favoritism is not allowed in this game. I hope it's the blue dude. Pink, yep, I knew it was going to be the pink dude. Okay, so this is the guy from the first area. From the demo. Da, 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 da. Who is it? Let me know. Alright, give him that blue pill. Or that green pill. Who is it? Hey, yo, who's this guy? Hi. It's Jin from Fluke. <laughs> I like that name. Fluke. He's always in search for the next uncharted planet to explore, as well as someone who wants to hear tales of his past adventures. I imagine pills are saved, right? So what we'll do is we'll clear the entirety of this area in night mode so that we can have a pill for the next flower dude we get, leaf dude, and see what goes down. Oh, I've got to upgrade Ochi again by the way. <laughs> just kind of swarm them and collect them all in one. I haven't actually been down here yet, like in, in the morning, which is quite funny. Hello puffy blog. Don't take your eyes off the luminol. Creatures are getting more active. Uh oh. Well, that's bad news. Is there one left? Three. Okay. Oh, the research pod's up here. Why is it up here? Is that meant to happen? I guess that's how I got here. Oh, you watch out! Oh God. Okay, this is kind of scary. Oh, oh, just got stabbed. Poor guy. Alright, keep defending, Ochi. We got this. Alright, don't blow my Luminol away, please. Okay, actually don't. Please. Okay, he should be dead, right? Perfect. Just my what's up? good. Okay, night mode is brilliant, I'll be honest. I love it. Ochi, by any chance can you take that guy out of the sky? That'd be handy. He's moving really slowly. <laughs> it's kind of scary. There we go, he's dead. Alright, we got a scare leaf incoming. 
Perfect. Get him, Ochi. Kaboom! They really like kick up the music when the thing starts getting attacked, don't they? We did it. Okay, so we'll do one more night mode and then we'll call it a day. Want to cover discovery? Glow Pikmin? Yep. Glow Pikmin are good. They go in water, they go in fire, they go in electric, they go in poison. Yeah, you know. Yeah, they replace Bulbman. It's true. And sad. Alright, who are we saying? Hey, yo! Captain Charlie? <laughs> Chet from Mihama. The leader of a diverse research task force. It may seem like he doesn't work at all, but he's the glue that keeps the team together. So, super buff, that's carrying. Chomp, level 3, let's get that. I'm guessing there's a chomp plus, I'm not sure. Yeah, big chomp. Watch a big chomp be able to, like, one-hit bosses. <laughs> uh, his wildest instincts. He can jump at flying things? What? <laughs> okay. Big chomp too. Uh, smaller creatures like Dwarf Bob David stand a chance <laughs> against the power of his chomp. <laughs> what? Okay, pluck, dig, heal. Heal could come in handy. But I'm gonna just go for another big chomp. Let's do it. Let's just go DPS. Like this guy's gonna show up. Bang! One hit people. Oh, okay, so it's not too powerful. I like that. Because with stuff like the carrying, it's like ridiculous how much he can carry. I was scared that, like, the big chomp was going to be like, oh, yeah, one hit, you know, every small enemy in the game that isn't a boss. <laughs> I'll, I'll check up on one of those dudes off camera and get all their missions done. Well, not the missions done, but get all their mission, like, wrote down so, you know, we can, get, we can get the raw material for it and stuff. Because it takes a while, so I don't want to do it on camera. One more night mode, and then we'll call it an episode, I think. Danger level two. Two glow thingies. Oh... We're on a double objective here. Are they going to like ring us and be like, there's two? Yep. Right tonight, this occasion, there's two glow things. Okay. Two glow saps, though. Of course. Duh, 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 duh. My hypothesis is that the two luminals are connected underground. What does that mean? Well, if one breaks, neither will release glow stuff. Ochi, you go defend the orange one. See ya. You have an insane bite now, so you should be able to do it in no time. They are very close to each other as well, which is good. Defend the blue one, actually, because I'm up here now. Using my Dandori skills, my dudes. Got tusked logs around here. Uh-oh. That's a weird thing to see. Right, just, uh... Get one of those. Uh-oh, something's pissed off. I don't know what. Yeah, here, here we got the... We got the children. So we can get rid of them if we delete this hole, I'm pretty sure. Okay, the music is not happy right now. We've got some at the Luminol. Oh, gee, have you got it? Yep, yep, yep. We've got the insane trailer music. Okay, Ochi actually dealt with it. Let's go. It's not over yet. I know. Trust me. Perfect. Okay, so they got rid of that. Let's get all these ones back. Is there any more up this way? There isn't. Okay. Up the wall, up the wall. Got Tusk Blogs incoming. Ochi, you got this, right? You got me covered? I hope so. I'm scared. They look damn cool with these eyes. That'll probably stay taken out for the morning, too, which is pretty cool. Right, we might need to have a swap to Ochi. Depending on how close things get. Is that guy even gonna... No, that guy wouldn't have made it, but now we've given him a way through. Which maybe wasn't a good idea. Because they can't go through the water, but it seems a bit. Go! Aha! Good joy. Perfect. Okay. I want to get, like, all of the star bits, but I don't know if I can get these ones up here. I'm missing something, but... Oh, gee, we did it, my friend. Okay. Good morning, good morning. And now we have an extra two pills, maybe. There's one. Is that it? 
Maybe. I swear, I swear he said something about two. You liar. I guess I didn't read it properly. I was looking forward to two uh, glow saps. Oh, never mind, we did get two. <laughs> okay, okay, well with that, I think we're going to end the episode. And also, we now have two pills for the next two leaflings we get, so that's perfect. Now we just got to find Olimar, find the rest of the castaways. I don't know. There's a lot to do in this game, and I love it. I love it. So, thank you guys for watching. I guess that'll be it. It's been a great episode. This game is absolutely crazy and bonkers, and I love it. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to subscribe, because we'll be doing a lot more Pikmin 4 content across the channel after this playthrough, and also this playthrough. It's just a bunch of Pikmin 4 content. So, if you enjoy it, stick around. And, yeah, thanks again for watching. Thank you to my supporters. You guys are the best. You make my dreams come true. Their names will be on screen in the outro just now. And, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.